Welcome to a tutorial video on Twine. In this video, I'm going to cover text rotation. We've seen how there are many, many, many different changer macros within Harlow. We can change the style, the size, the color, the background color, all kinds of things we can change as a result of using different macros and potentially chaining them or combining them together. We can also rotate text in different ways, and there are three sister macros for this task. We can rotate along the X, the Y, and the Z axis, all within Harlow by using the corresponding macros to do that. So let's look at some examples of this. So let's say, for example, we wanted to apply an enchantment such that the text was rotated along the X axis 30 degrees. Well, text rotate X with hyphens between those, we'll rotate it by 30 degrees. If we want to rotate on Y, it's text rotate Y. If we want to rotate on Z, it's text rotate Z. Now I can say those three things, X, Y, and Z, but let's play this to see what those enchantments actually do, because they may not be immediately evident based on the axis that we think are being applied within a web browser. So here is a rotation on the x-axis, here is a rotation on the y, and this is a rotation on the z down here. Notice that it immediately becomes very hard to read if we're not careful how we do it. So notice right here, x is this axis, kind of tilting it backwards, y is kind of tilting into the page along that x-axis, and z is a rotation along this right here. And let's move over to example two to see what this looks like. So if I go ahead and start the story over here in example two, let's open up a new tab. Um, notice that text kind of just disappears if we're not careful with it. So let's go ahead and adjust these values. Notice I set this at 60, but example two right here was set at 90. And if we go over to, oh, I, um, I, don't, I don't see it anymore, right? Example two and example four, and these are completely unreadable Z right? Although sealable, but unreadable. So over here, particularly example seven, which is an enchantment of a text rotation of 180 degrees along Z, produces basically text that's upside down right here. So example seven is completely upside down. Example six, moving over here on Z, is 90 degrees up and down right here. And five is set at 60. So now it's kind of at an angle right here. However, these other two, as enchantments, basically make them disappear. And in fact, if I set this instead of 90 to, let's say, 180, right, 180. So if we set this to 180, and then we build and play, notice we kind of kind of like a backwards upside down look. So keep in mind, within certain angles are basically unreadable or creates kind of a very hard to read effect. Now, you may want this. So I've, I've mentioned it as kind of a flaw within the tone I've applied, but you may want this to be unreadable as you deal with text rotation. Just be very careful and definitely test values before you give it to another player or user to see. But we can create interesting visual effects. Again, text rotation X, text rotation Y, text rotate Z are all changer macros, just like any other changer macro we've now seen within Harlow 3.3. And as I've also shown here, and but didn't initially comment on, they're part of enchantments, right? We are enchanting certain particular texts or words or phrases or hooks, I could have done as well, and we are changing how they appear. So within the rotation, if we want to, we can play with X, Y, and Z, although again, being very careful of readability. If they are certain values within the X, Y, or Z plane, of, or axis, I should say, they will disappear and not quite be readable. Otherwise, it could create some interesting visual effects and create an interesting visual presentation, potentially of the way a character might speak, or if we wanted to present certain effects like madness or insanity, although again, being very careful with those, of how we present readability within those texts, but useful if we want another way to apply changer macros along the X, Y, and Z planes within Harlow 3.3. Thanks for watching.